What's up guys, this is Brixelite signing in and welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica. Now, yesterday, this is where all my skills came in tuition and I did fucking amazing at dying with these five zombies right here. I have more health. I have used my green herb, uh, sadly, but I'm not endangered while I'm here. Hopefully I can um, run away from these bitches this time around, but I can't use my action, my analog stick to run with, so... Bear in mind, that's the thing I need to work with. But I can shoot from over this fence. Which is quite good. Excuse me, sir, do you want to stop trying to fucking grab me? Alright, these guys are all lined up behind a fence, so this is good for me. Let me try and fucking shoot him. Turn the volume up. Claire, please, thank you. We good? No. Back up a little bit. Come, bitch. Claire, now's the time not to fucking reload bullets. Alright, there we go. He's dead. All of them are dead, right? Didn't use that many bullets, too. Still on orange, but hey. We've done better. We've done worse. At least we can progress with the game. Also, need to save it as soon as I can. Because, um... <laughs> we just need to. <laughs> you know? Take the biohazard card? Uh, yes, please. I'll need that for the... Other area, I think. Oh, wait, yes, I'm not beaten there yet, have I? So, alright, cool. Let me grab these, Claire, please. Claire, thank you. I think the reason why I actually like grew to still enjoy this game after so many years is because Claire is my favorite Resident Evil character. Out of all of them, Leon being second. <laughs> Hence why I enjoy Resident Evil 2 so much. Man, the remake was perfect. What I was told, or what the demo likes to tell me, is that when you've got this, bats don't affect you. And I want to kind of test that theory out. Might have to go back into a room we've already been into, but... Just in case, I've not picked up the Navy Seal this time around. I totally forgot about bullets being here. Whoops. Yeah, I've not picked up the um, the Navy Seal this time around because I just left the dogs be. Just so I can survive this attack here. And uh, obviously I can um, survive. Our bats going to be affected to me. They're going to attack me. No, they don't. Alright, nice to know. Right, let's get that sorted like we did last time. Now I know that I can actually be protected against bats. It's going to be a pain when I lose that for the lockpick, but, oh well. Shit has to be done, right? The rest of those bullets will have to be safe for dogs. I've not learned how to fight them yet, but I feel like we're done with this area for now until we find a lever, which is later on in the game. I need these bullets because there's dogs, which I could be able to avoid, possibly, but I do need the Navy Seal at some point. But I might get that last when I've got, like, plenty more bullets. Because where we should be going to today is a little bit more better. But yes, we will be saving it. And we can save those there when we need it and stuff. But hey, at least we're actually making progress now. I'm not sucking all the dick. There we go. <clears throat> I would love it if they, like, like, made this game a little bit more spooky than normal. As in, like, when you're in the submarine or when you go in the area, you see, like, a hunter swimming around somewhere. That would have been pretty fucking cool. Obviously, when the hunters do turn up in the game, which is quite a well away from here, but... Oh, well. Yes, please, we need to go back the way we came from. Thank you. I put all that wheel spin just to go back into normal civilization. <laughs> Alright, cool. I need some more health, though, game. And I feel like... Well, no, because I don't need that, though, do I? I can't carry it with me. Alright, I'm going to have to deal with these dogs now. Because they're a pain in the ass. I don't know where the dog is. Back up a little bit. want to hear him running. I know how to deal with him. Shit, Claire! There we go. 
I've learned how to fight the dogs. Not that one, though. Or that one, either. I can, I can take a bite. I can take a bite. Bad doggy. Naughty boy. I'm in danger already. Fuck. This isn't good, to be honest. The way I've got to go through from here is not good. Well, no, I haven't got a lot of bullets left, and where we've got to go to has three, maybe four zombies. And I don't want to deal with that shit. I don't want to die again. So, just so this is set in stone now, the damage that is about to... <gasps> I didn't see this! Hi, did not see that. Hello, how are you, friend? Lovely to meet you. I didn't know this was here. I could have held on to this, need this desperately. Oh, that put me to yellow. I must have only entered red then. That's nice. That means we can save it again. If anything goes bad, we can just, you know, load it from here. Like in the next video if recording goes wrong. But because I've got a new recording device and had problems trying to get it to work and realized it actually was an easy fix, <laughs> 360s make reckless things for hard drives. <laughs> Which I never even knew about. <laughs> Go figure. Go fucking figure, dude. Alright, cool. I need this. <laughs> I actually need these now. <laughs> Alright, let's go save the game. Just so we know what we're doing. Okay. This was yesterday. This would have been yesterday's save point, basically. We've got that. Come back here. Got into this room and saved it. Because we didn't miss much, basically. All I did was get a key code or key card. Alright, let's put that away. For some reason, I don't know why that's there. Let's put that up there. Navy Seals is important, so I'm going to put that down there. Nice. There is another item in there somewhere, but not important because we don't need it. <laughs> I never knew there was a green herb there. I could have survived a little bit longer. Next green herb we'll get, I'll probably not use. I'll save it till I get... Like, if I knew about that, I would have had two double greens used up. I would probably would have survived a little bit longer yesterday. So I used it when I was on danger, wasn't that something like that? Oh no, I used it when I was on orange. So I would have used it to go to green. That would have been a bit better. But hey, next trick is these fucking zombies down here though. To go into the other area we've not been to yet. Which has, I believe it has the bow gun. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I believe it has the bow gun. This is why I need to like, save the bullets for. <laughs> Apparently, that guy down there is not getting shot. Is that enough? I'm assuming they're both dead. Now I've only got five bullets to my name. Hmm. Is the next one not going to be problematic, though? Nah, he's not too problematic. I can avoid him. I can avoid him, too, with these. Simple stuff, those two. Simple stuff. I'm hoping we don't die before the save points. This thing, the ant threat. I've run away from this thing for a mile. Rawr! I'm a big snake demon! Blah. Dodge it, Claire! Lovely stuff, girl, lovely stuff. Love it. Run, child. Run, child. Run, child! We do not want to get eaten by the big snake thingy yet. Thank you. There is a few zombies in here, but a few more bullets as well, so. And a green herb. <laughs> oh, that's a red herb. Fuck. I need a green. Hey, dude, that'll be coming handy if I find a green. I don't want to go that way just yet. That's why I have the key code for the card, I believe. I see the clip here as well. Nice. Bogo's actually a pretty good fucking gun. Okay, door number one. Then we'll go up the other way, come back down. It might say you're not allowed to come through here yet. I see him. I hear the rest. See some more bogum bolts, I guess. The machine can be used as a printer. Can you print the map then? Yes, please. Thank you. Right, we'll take the map. Thank you. Okay. I, I took a fifth. Now here's where fucking shit goes horribly wrong. And we nailed it! 
I killed my first zombie with a knife without getting hurt. Now this is where it really gets fucking tough. If I remember correctly, I should be able to open this and get some bullets. Shit. <laughs> Not where I thought it were then. Okay, what about around there? I know there's a zombie on the floor. Please? How do you live? How do you live? Fuck it. He, he got hurt. He, he did get killed. Ooh! Is that a green herb I see? You fucking know it, boy. Hold on, Mr. Zombie Friend. I'm going to be using this very fucking soon, by the way. So, uh, please bear with. Alright, friend. You try and, like, keep my distance away from you. Can I, like, aim for the head? Oh, you actually can aim for the head! Oh! Interesting. Holy shit! I'm fucking badass. I didn't even get hurt by that fucking zombie. I'm a king. Fucking bow before your queen, bitches. The fuck's in this closet? Nothing. Cool. What the fuck's in here then? Simple lock? It's locked. It, it seems I need a special key to release a lock. How about this kind of special key? No? Okay. That's fine. I think I know what's in there anyway, and I don't think it's anything important. But I've got a full health thing. And I will take what I have. Why are you looking at the zombie? You are looking at the zombie. That's alright then. Two of them. To be exact. I'm a queen. Fear me, because I am fucking good. Alright, door number two. We're gonna try and survive with just a knife. <laughs> I've gotta beat this game using a knife only as well. Bring it, bitch! Not good. Oh, wow, we got him. This is all you need. Because if you get it angled right, you can do fucking five knife sacks at once. Who's next? I can open one of these. I'm sure I can. Slowly but surely we can open one of these. Maybe all the ones that are open. <laughs> I've got two, two zombies now. Three zombies now. It's a little bit more threatening when you've got a few zombies to deal with at once. Hey, do just pile them up. Oh shit. Come on. Get them. Get them all. Shit. Come on, Claire. Shit. I didn't want him to have a bite. Okay. Go. Go. Fuck off. Fucking getting crowded by these bastards. One bites you, the fucking next one bites you. Can we get all three in one fucking swing? Apparently not. Now he's gonna bite me. No. Apparently not. Come the fuck on! I just walked into him on that one. <sighs> it's a good thing I fucking saved it when I did, isn't it? Because I'm going to die in this fucking room with these things. One's dead. Finally. I'm not dangered yet. Now I'm dangered. Don't care, though, because I might as well just die at this point. Oh, now I kill them both? Fuck me, dude. Fucking hell. You should have bullets on him, right? No more bogan arrows. I would love a bogan right about now. I feel like it would be fucking grand to have in my possession. Oi. Oh, shit! What the fuck is wrong with this guy? Come on. It may have surprised me, but fuck. I saw there's a lot of hot air inside. Yeah, I know. And there's zombies down here, too. Just the one. Come on, Claire. Come on, bitch! I feel like I can take you all out with danger health. We'll take it slow. Don't get bitten by him. You got bit by him. Alright, cool. We're going to have to reload and catch it to where we are then. Sweet. Wrong button. Yay! Where am I? We're here. Cool. Alright, cool. Jump cuts where we need to be.
Okay. Here we are again in my room where I know where zombies are hiding now. <laughs> I'm not gonna f fucking surprise me. Come on, bitch. I'm getting fucking good with this goddamn knife. That's three zombies I've killed in a row without being fucking touched, bitch. Do you want to make it number four? I took a chance on one of them because one was hiding on the floor. And then I wanted to, like, hope for the best that I didn't, you know, want to get... I got bit by one of them on purpose. It was one of my rule goals. All right. No zombies in here? That's good. Stop the water flow. There's no response. Somewhere there should be a circulation pipe. Okay. Cool. This is where I was supposed to be. And then let's turn this thing. Oh, five minutes from now, we'll um, try and find another save point. <laughs> Ooh. It's good. We've got full health. I'm not being bit by a single zombie by using my knife yet. I see how people learn how to use the knife in the game. Like, aim for the head. They drop to the floor. You could survive a lot of bullets. Ooh! I know why I need that. That's the special key type thingy. Alright. Good thing I cleared that out of that room. I wasn't going to. I went straight through. Well, I didn't go straight through here. I went in this corridor first to use the bullets I saved. And then went to use the knife. Because I need the bullets, sir. Uh... Don't know if one of those can be opened or not. Don't know. Don't care. <laughs> I'm good with a knife, dude. I'm fucking sound with this goddamn knife. And then we can um, go explore what's through down that corridor and shit. Because we can't save it until we find a save it. We don't know where that is yet. But we have a special key tag. Hopefully it's for the fucking crossbow. I'm hoping it is. If it is, I'm going to be pissed off at myself. No, it is those things, and they are fucking amazing. So, we're gonna use this. They are beautiful fucking things. You save those for the big boys. <laughs> By big boys, I mean something called a bandersnatch. That is the only thing you use them on. <laughs> this is legit the only way we can do it. Okay, cool. Explore further down here then and hope for the best because we haven't had to lock this place off yet You know right this is missing a door handle All right cool, and this is what gets locked off. I think See if this way or the other way So I think you're supposed to come down here first Hello Not gonna look through the window just yet There is a note and a bogan. Why did I not come in here first? For fuck's sake. Memo on the pass number. The emergency door lock system in the biology experiment room can be released with the four digit pass number. I hope you haven't forgotten about that already. I have just received an order from the system administrator requesting us to change the pass number periodically. What bothers me is that you often lose important memos, pass numbers, or even chemicals. So, in an attempt to solve that problem, I came up with an idea. You know the red human skeleton picture at the back of the biology experiment room? I have decided to use the number sign on the picture as the pass number. If you happen to lose the memo, just look at the picture. Well, I don't think you would ever need to use the emergency pass number anyway, but just in case, now you know. Take it easy, Mr. Careless. <laughs> Alright, sweet. I have a fucking gun now. Because I can use all these for it. Hell yeah, dude. Ah! Oh, I, I need this. This weapon I need. Right, can we look through the window? There we go. This is what should have happened at the beginning of the game, but we kind of jumped the gun a little bit. That over there has the code I need. But we don't need to come down here yet until I have the code. I can't get the door open. That was the snatch I was talking about as well, which is quite ironic we do that now. I fucking hate the snatch. It's a dickhead fucking thing. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging in the back. I can't see the number from here. Emergency door locks system activated. The door says bio experiment. A normal air, I can't enter the pass number. Okay. So shouldn't this close down then? If I remember correctly, we can go down the other corridor because I have like the key code or the key passcode. Pass. Hazard contamination. Swiper. Level three. 
Because this is what we're supposed to do first. Go get the code and then come back. But I don't have the code yet to open the door. So there's no point for this yet. Leave it be for now. She's fucking badass. She definitely takes after her brother. Must be in the Redfield. Definitely the Redfield family. Do not want to come across... So should I be able to use a code on this now? They're like, okay, when ventilation is complete. Okay, I see. So I can't do that yet. However, I can go down here now. Because I have this. And this is somewhere new. No zombies. Cool. That's great. Safe point would be great. Oh, fuck. Oh, here's Alfred again. Two days in a row now we see this fucker. She can dodge well, leave that. Do I just stay in here? No, I need to go. Let's go. Okay, he's a fight. God, is a fucking poor shot. I've just seen him run away. I've just heard him run away, even. Alright. So I wouldn't know where to use the blue, the blue fucking shield thing. Because there's two locations and one doesn't feel important enough. Alright, what's down here? Ooh, I can go down there. What's that in the corner? There's like something there, but it might just be a box. Can we go down here, Claire? Never mind, we can't go down there just yet. Alright, cool. Let's follow Alfred. So I can only go through one door then? I didn't see him run through that door, so it must be this door he ran through. Well, the wolfy doggy on the door. And I got a thump thump. This is the thump thump. Oh god, fucking windows. Fucking hate windows. Ooh, pistol bullets. Grab them. The pistol is better than the, um, the, whatever it's called. But I'm glad I got the bowgun now. So I should have had the bowgun <laughs> for quite a while. And it does give you a lot of bullets to start it off with. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> that fucking hate is good. Consider the area you are in a special... Playground I have prepared just for you. <laughs> Please try and keep me amused. And do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I I'm waiting for it to giggle again. want to enjoy this. <laughs> that fucking giggle. She's thinking, okay. Well, I was originally going to go in this room. I feel like this is the safe room. Not too sure. I'm hoping it is so I can use it to use as a safe room. You know? Get somewhere in life. This is not where I wanted to be. That is not the room I want to go in. There's banders in there and I'm not ready for a bander just yet. I'd like to have a lockpick first. Is this where I get the thermostat? In this room? I think it is. Well, we can go back. And go get myself a lockpick and stuff to get some more good equipment. I think. Should be on the couch if this is the room. Well, there's a safe point for us. Is this the room I wanted to look at? And there's the thermostat on the... Yep, there it is. We can take that hemostatic. Cool. Well, I don't think I've got anything to put away right now. Even the hemostat's going to stay on me because I know where I'm going to go for that. We can deal with that. Where's the closest safe point to that? It's in there, so to go that way. I'll keep it on me until I need to get rid of it. No, 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 no. I don't need that just yet. I mean, I know where they'll be. My controller just fucking died. That happened pretty instantaneously. Love that. That's good. That means I can get these charged up after I've done this a little bit. Alright. Nope. Give me this. Thank you. Just so I can save the game, Claire. Well, anyway, though, 
whilst we know I'm going to save the game now. Control keeps on fucking dying on me. No. Yes. Yeah, it still has a little bit more minutes in it. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there for today with this video of Resident Evil Code Veronica. We shall continue with more of this tomorrow. I'm trying to save the fucking game. But either way, though, that is all there is going to be for today. And as always, this is Rick's Light signing out. So let's cue the music. Fucking batteries. <laughs> <laughs>